All right, hi everyone, and I hope you're having a great Wednesday. I want to spend a couple minutes today telling you about our Servanthood Sunday to Sunday event that we're having at Calvary starting this Sunday through the following Sunday. So if you've been at Calvary for a while, you know that we usually do a Servanthood Saturday or a Servanthood Sunday a couple of times a year where we go around town in groups and do projects at a lot of local schools, homes and organizations. But of course, because of so many of the safety protocols, that's not possible right now. So we're going to do a twist and we're going to do a week of serving projects and encouraging every single person in our church and anyone who wants to join us from the community to be doing um, serving projects, whether it's individual or family projects or group projects. But each one of these is something that you can do no matter where you're at on um, the safety protocols. So things to do on your own, things to do um, socially distanced. So I'm gonna give you some of the project overviews right now and also encourage you to go to yourcalvary.info slash SS for Servanthood Sunday to see a list of all of the projects and ideas and to sign up so that we can give you more information. So some of the projects we're going to be doing are going to be group projects. So on Monday and on Wednesday of next week, we're going to be prepping and serving dinner at transitional housing. So if you feel comfortable doing a project like that, um, you can jump in with that. Next Thursday here at the church, we're doing a blood drive and we need to have at least 25 people signed up to make that happen. So you can do the blood drive as one of them. We have several groups going around to local schools doing painting on the um, parking lots like Foursquare and Hopscotch and doing some landscaping and things. So those are great projects to do on your own time or with a couple of friends. And then we also, if you go to the Info Hub card and scroll down, you can see that we have some guided prayer walks. So you could choose to do a prayer walk around the Purdue campus. You could do one around your neighborhood. You could choose to go downtown in Lafayette and do a, a prayer walk there on your own or maybe with your kids or with a good friend. So lots of ways to serve. But let me show a few of the things where it's an individual project, but part of a bigger group effort. And starting this Sunday, you can come by and pick things up here at the church. So we have, um, we're collecting food pantry items as well as things like socks and underwear for transitional housing. And there's a full list of their top needs on the info hub. So starting Sunday, you can drop those off. And actually on Thursday, we'll have a very specific time where you don't even have to get out of your car. I'm gonna be out there with the buckets and hopefully we'll be able to get a lot of pantry items for them. We also have 50 of these sidewalk chalk kits that you can pick up and find a place around town. Maybe it's your neighborhood, maybe it's um, the driveway of a teacher or something because our teachers definitely need encouragement right now where you can take the sidewalk chalk and just add some encouraging uh, positive um, notes with the sidewalk chalk. We also have 48 of these activity kits for kids. And so very similar to how we do Operation Christmas Child, you would at the church come pick up the empty plastic box and the instructions. And then you're going to fill that with some activities. Like in here, we've got some coloring items, some stickers, some thread for making friendship bracelets. And those are going to go to kids who've been displaced from their homes and are at the carry house. We also have 90 of these bright yellow yard signs. And so you would come, you would pick up one or two of the blank yard signs with instructions. We have a list of suggested uh, messages that you can put on them and you're gonna just design it yourself and you're going to put the messages on. We've got the stakes and then we're going to put 90 of these around our community um, just to, to put some encouraging messages out there. So there's a lot that we can't do right now, but there's a lot that we can do. And so we want you to go to the Info Hub read all of the options, come up with some creative ones of your own. As always, if you have ideas or someone you know who needs help um, and need help figuring out the logistics or the funding of that, that's what we're here for. And so you can reach out to me personally and I'll do my best to help make that happen. So please continue to let us know if there's needs in the community that we can help with and think and pray this week about what you can do next week to serve our community with our Calvary Servanthood Sunday to Sunday. Have a great day.